Hello, Chip Towers of the Atlanta Journal-Constitution and AJC.com, back here on a bright and sunny Tuesday afternoon at the Butts Mayor Heritage Hall football complex at the University of Georgia. Uh, looking bright and sunny, certainly, in Georgia's landscape this week. Uh, Georgia coming off that huge win uh, over LSU, 44-41. to and Georgia moves up from 9-6 to six in the polls, and now they're getting ready to play Tennessee up on Rocky Top in Knoxville. So the theme of the day uh, for Coach Mark Rick and his players who we talked to here today, uh, no letdown. You know, at least 100,000 people will be there cheering against us. Uh, you know, we'll have a few people wearing red and black in there, but it won't be many compared to what, what we're going to be facing. But, um, you know, a really uh, outstanding football team, great coaching staff. They're, um, I know they're hungry for a big vic victory, and, um, but we are too. I think Coach Rick said it in his press conference Sunday or something like that about, you know, this team's good, but I don't know how good they are if they're not focused, and it's true. Uh, we're, I think the reason why we've been so successful is because we've been extremely focused every day in practice in the film room. I mean, last week in practice was probably the best, best week of practice I've ever seen. I think I've been saying that every week. Oh, it's been a great practice because it has been. Our guys are, are very focused when, when it comes to what we do in film preparation and, and what we do out there on the practice field. And I think that's why, like I said, we've been so successful because we're putting in the work uh, during the week to get ready for Saturday. Biggest question on everybody's mind heading into this week is All-American tailback Todd Gurley going to be ready to go. Uh, Gurley goes out with 10 minutes left in the second quarter against LSU. Todd obviously sprained his ankle, didn't finish the game, and uh, we're listing him day to day, and, and it's because we just don't know how long it's going to take. Uh, we'll practice this afternoon, and I think it's very doubtful he'll practice today, but um, we'll just kind of take it one day at a time. We have playmakers, and we know we have uh, guys, you know, who play their roles, and, you know, we got a great quarterback, and we got great receivers, and great play calling, so uh, on offense, we just got to execute. They'll play again this week, 3.30 p.m., the CBS National Game, and we'll be there to bring you all the coverage. For now, it's Chip Towers with the Atlanta Journal-Constitution and AJC.com.